Okay, today I'm going to show you a little bit about sharing and social media on your blog, on a Wix blog specifically. This is a Wix uh, blog that I designed for a client. Um, with, with each of these posts, there's a little read more. That's where we're going to go to actually share these individual posts. But um, also in Wix, you have the ability to add social media icons. Make sure you customize these. When you drop in your social media icons or if you're using a template that already has them, make sure you click on these in the Wix editor and add your specific businesses or personal accounts, Facebook information, uh, or the link, I should say, the Twitter link, Instagram, or whatever you're using here. If you don't customize these, they do, by default, go to the Wix Facebook account and the Wix Twitter account and so forth. So um, that's really important to make sure you add those. Uh, your actual personal links um, here. Now this will basically open up the page. I'm linking it straight to their business page on Facebook. So that's what you see if I click on any of these. Now there's another uh, social media aspect to Wix blogs and that's the sharing um, social media icons which appear below. Uh, all the blog templates by default have these little share icons below the posts. Um, if I click on this, what this does is opens up a, um, a window that says, oh, you can share it on Facebook. It's going to pull my personal account if I'm logged in under my personal account. And so if I want to post as my business, you have to click here on share on your timeline for this drop down and choose share on a page. And then you can choose a page that you want to share as and share this post as. This is good if you want to post on your, your uh, business page on Facebook and so forth. So this is just something to keep in mind when you first click on this it's going to pr probably most likely pull up a personal account. You have to change this to here. You can share it in a group. You can share it on a timeline um, and you can share it on a page that you manage and then you simply choose that page um, whatever you want it to be to share as that page. So you would have to have access to the business account for that page under this account that you're logged in as in order for that to be available but um, if you want to do it this way, that's one way you can share it. Now, there's another way you can share these, and this is how I typically do it. It's one way is not better than the other, but um, I will just copy the link of whatever blog posts I want to share, and then I'm going to go into Facebook, and um, I'll log in as one of my pages. So in this case, I'm going to do... Uh, my pickle wicks page and then I can simply paste um, that link and share this blog post on my personal page so I can say oh here's a great blog post about one of my clients who has takeout in Jackson Hole so <laughs> um, that's another way to do it so there's I guess that way actually seems a little bit more cumbersome um, so probably just using going straight to the thing and using one of these would actually be a little bit easier um, but I just wanted to show you how to access your business Facebook page when sharing this. So these are actually sharing links. They're not links to your business page. That's what these are for. Um, oftentimes they're on the, the template of most sites. Um, uh, so like this one has it here. So these actually go to the business pages and that's fine. This sharing link is something different and that's what you get under the blog. Um, these are actually sharing buttons, not not just links to your business site. So you can't even control what these open because it just depends on the user and what they're logged in as under um, Facebook or Twitter and so forth. Um, if they're not logged in, they'll probably get a, a not logged in message. Let's try LinkedIn, for example. I don't know if I'm logged in as that. Um, looks like I might be logged in, but you'll get, a, you have to log in to share or whatever, which is common as well. So anyway, that's all. Good luck. Happy Wixen.